yeah good day guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys is doing fine today i'm going to share with you how you can make a cleaning service flyer on your android smartphone exactly like this kindly watch and learn a new skill thank god bless you please consider subscribing to our youtube channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new videos let's start with today's tutorial Decography skills with creativity. Guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys is doing absolutely great. It's your boy Decographic. I'm here this uh, evening to show you how you can make a professional cleaning service flyer on your Android smartphone as usual using your PC lab. In this tutorial, I will give you a hint give you an hint on what you learn you are going to learn exactly how can you can make awesome uh cleaning service flyer on your android smartphone how you can use your gradients how you can combine elements how you can follow the alignment principle and in hierarchy in this tutorial you need to pay much attention because i'm going to explain step by step how I'm going to combine all those elements one after the other. Without wasting much of our time, let's get started. As I do so, the first thing to determine or to use or to choose or to think of whenever you want to make any kind of design is called size and size color. I'm going to the size and I'm going to select the kind of size I want. But I don't need to select anything because this is the size I want to use. One three zero by one three zero. We call it square size because the length and the breadth are the same. After that, I will go to the background color. Then I will choose the color that I want for myself. I choose this light yellow color. Now I will go to my gallery. Then import the overlay layer, which is this. I will click it. Then use my relative or relative size to position in there. Then click on the layer and lock it. After this has been achieved, the next thing that we are going to do is to go to our gallery and import the other element one after the other. <laughs> then after we imported this, we are going to scale it by allowing the width and the height to be the same. Then we go to the lock and lock it. Now this time around, we are coming to our shape. We expand our shape to be at this level. As you can see, it has to be at this level. Then after selecting our shape, shape we won't do anything with it. We we'll go back to our gallery. Then we've made a mistake here. We have to delete this. Then go back and select the second image. This image needs to be at the bottom here. Then after putting it at the bottom, we go back to our layer, then we hide it. After this has been done, then we look at this, uh, we are going to deal with this shape. By increasing the shape a little bit. After increasing the shape, we center the middle. Then we make this one to come down, then we center the middle of the head. Of the head of the bottom image. Everything will plumb like this. Sorry, we back, back. Then we go to back to the where we select the shape by applying the radius a little bit, exactly like this. Good, which is twenty-five. After selecting it to be twenty-five, then we are going to adjust and position it here. Then we bring it front. Then after bringing it front, we are going to use the two color all together, blue and the light yellow. So we go to gallery, then we apply this particular color. So after applying the color, then we are going to send it to the back. Now go to the layer, then have it lock. Then one thing that we need to do is to make the overlay to what will be at the back of it. 
so that it will not show. Now we are succeeding in making this work. But the next thing that we are going to do, use the radius of 25 as well. Then we have to crop this and make sure that one go in and one go out. Then we return back this and position it here. We can turn on the middle of this to set it properly to see how it work. And this should be at the back of this. This is absolutely okay. Then after making it like this, the next thing we are going to do is to set it, send it back. After sending it back, we are going to make it be on top of the first chip by bringing it up. Now it's actually cool like this because why do I hide add the white element to the back of this uh, bottom image is because the color of the uh, uh, of the cloth that the lady is w wearing uh, already rhyme with the color of the background to make it sure we have to put a lighter color at the back to make it plum now we are actually making sense with the way we are setting everything up and we are almost there but this one need a lot a little adjustment after we are able to set up everything like this the next thing that we are going to do after making it up like this let me check properly to check whether we can shift this up a little bit we can shift it up because everything is actually right then we can go back to our gallery select the image as a means of identification of the company then after bringing it and maintain the aspect ratio we are going to lock it make sure everything is being locked so that our hand will not just be touching and be removing it. Now the next thing we are going to do is to go with the write-up and the brand name of the company. So we are going to type first professional. Professional. So after typing the professional, we go to the font type that we want to use. We go to the recent. Then the font I want to use is already known. And the font I want to use, to use, let me just use uh, Roboto. Let's look at how Roboto will be. So I'm using Roboto font. Then there will be a little space in between here, which should in, which must be set properly. Then I go to the color and choose a light yellow, which is this, or I use the deep yellow. After making this work, then I will put a little space in between the alphabet, exactly like this. After setting this, and uh, it already work, I have to reduce the size a little bit. I have to reduce the size. I think this is absolutely correct. Now I will go back to the text area, then I will type cleaning service. many services now we go back this is the main brand name i mean the the major work that the flyers carry so you need more attention so it means we have to give it more hierarchy so the hierarchy go with this by choosing a button that can actually spell out what the company is all about so, so now this has been selected I have to increase the size a little bit so good this has been selected as you can see so the next thing I'm going to do with this is to go to the board just board it go to the color and choose white color to make everything okay after this click the empty space then I have a lorem being copy so that it doesn't work then i have to to choose if this doesn't work then 
I have to cancel this, cancel it, then go to the code. We can we what 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 are the code that I can use here? Yeah. So let me look at it. Get action since the moment man was never intended to become an oyster. So this is actually okay. And I'm going to use a Roboto form for this. Let me select it first because that is only Roboto fit work here. So you select the Roboto. Uh, 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 then we go to the size. We reduce the size. We can actually be in two lines. Basically. So now, now that we've done it that way, let's go there and select it as well. So very cool, very cool. So after selecting it this well, we are going to give it a white color. So since everything seems to be deep, exactly like this, I'm going to select the Roboto that will have a lighter font. So we have a Roboto roboto font so let's go there then let's choose the roboto that can let's choose the regular regular should be able to work but now that everything is being scattered the next thing you can do to rectify this is to recover the auto save then you can see everything come back so now i'm not going to make everything look like that again I'm going to select the right font I'm going to use. So after that, let your alarming start from the left. Then you position it very well. So you can actually still reduce the size to like something like 16. 16 will have even be plumb. Then after setting it, we go to the shape. I mean to the color. Then we select the white color. Now this actually fits in here this is where we are going to work i'm going to go to my gallery then i'm going to go to the shape exactly like this select the shape so after select this i'll click ok now i must find this place for this shape here it must have a space because this is the space that are so fatter but not necessary that it should be touch anything so it should be here very cool so now that this is here i have to use my opacity to make it transparent so so uh preferably i will make this one deep a little bit i will make it deep a little bit so after making it deep i can now let me see. Let it come here. Let it come here. So let it have it. Let have it been here. So it must be obvious. So we stay in Greece. We stay in Greece. So it's abs absolutely okay like this very very okay but let me still increase a little bit to something like 79 so as it is we can actually see that this actually plummet then to make everything okay i'm going here and after i got in there i'm going to where i select this and make sure that uh, this absolutely come up yeah to make it look like uh, it actually rhymes so you can see so very good there should just be a little space in between them now very good now go to the text area then we type home cleaning you see home cleaning home cleaning so you can see this one we are going to copy this then we we'll go to the uh, font type. We we'll select a leak pattern. Then we reduce the size to a barest minimum level. Then we go to we we'll go to space in between in between text. 
so after it has been done this way then let me give four five after it must uh, after I've done it that way we go to uh, color we give it a white color then we are going to position it very well so let there be space in between this let there be space now the size of this need to be reduced since we are inputting more than one there so i guess 19 should be okay then we copy this before the adjustment let me cancel this and we adjust this so that we won't be adjust them one after the other so it's actually okay oh sorry I thought I'm adjusting this. So later this is we have a office cleaning. Office cleaning. So let this one come down. So after making this to be here, then we look at the third one, which is hotel cleaning. Hotel cleaning. Think this is absolutely okay but uh, I have to make a kind of adjustment here by making this one go a little bit here. so I have to move it back to make sure that everything rhymes that is what I mean by alignment so in making all these things there should be a kind of a breathing space in between them so select let this come to this side a little bit more then after that we are going to use the same method to position this one here. Then the last one should be at this place, at this point. So we we'll make sure that uh, it actually rhymes too. So now we're making sense. We can adjust this a little bit for the line between them to rhyme. So now the next, the next thing is to just plug in something is inside here sorry just plug it hold it drag it down let it be around this place so now move it in so let's check and see how it look it should be very okay so i'm thinking this one is a uh, um, let me check this other one. I want it to be too tiny than that one. So let this be here. Then we'll move it. So good. So at this juncture, this should be very okay. So we, we position it here. So we can copy the same thing. After copy, use the relative position. Then you use the movement arrow to move it down here. So you see how it look. So we can use a grid to know whether they really rhyme. On the top is rhyme, the rest should be rhyme. So this is absolutely okay. So as it is, we can switch, move this to this side. This should be moved to this side. So I think we can now adjust this a little bit. So let, let's move it a little bit. Yeah. So this is cool, right? It's cool. But I'm thinking of something. So let's reduce this a little bit. Reduce this a little bit. So this is absolutely okay. So as, is, as it is now, I'm thinking of still reduce the size of this to 18 or 17. So this should be reduced to 17.
this should be reduced to reduced to 17 okay so now we'll move this one down a bit this should go down a bit so very good so this can go down a bit so we can now we can now start to move it we can start moving it so very good so now that we've achieved this the next thing that we're going to do is to complete the write up so i'm going to use just type here call so we have call here so call plus uh, plus two three four so we have seven or oh, three so we have four six six so this is the number we'll go to the gallery and choose uh, i mean font and choose accidental president font so after selecting accidental president we'll position that one here then we give it uh, a blue color sorry we give it a blue color by using the color picker pick the color of the class then we select just put it there so we we'll pick that color then our website the website we are going to put it there www then you can see the logo there you can see it there you see deco so we have uh, www.deco.com so you can actually send that then we are going to position that here we are going to position it here and there should be space in between them so very 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 good and we are almost random so now the next thing we are going to do is to copy no is to copy one of these then we'll go to 25 percent of 25 percent of so we'll go to the color that we want to select so i'm selecting this color so after selecting that color we're going to position that here and that should be here so after that we are going to copy then we we are going to clear the condition on so we have on first on first you see on first so that is what on first service so it should be on first service on first services so we make it this way capital letter or then after that we change the color to white so after that we position it here it should carry the same alignment so this is absolutely okay so now there should be a little space in between them so let's do a justification on them so you can see this is true one two so justification in between the tails there should be a one line so we have one i put one so the one that should be a space in between them so this is exactly how you can make a uh, uh, a clean service flyer on your Android smartphone using your PC lab. I hope this is helpful. If this one is helpful, kindly comment. Drop your comment on the uh, uh, on the comment section and suggest which uh, 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 next design do you want me to make for you guys. Your comment will be well appreciated. Thank for watching. God bless you. Click on the save, save with Ultra, with the 